Hello, in this mobile how-to video I'm going to be showing you a few ways to customise your home screen on the Motorola Moto E. Now the first way to customise any mobile phone would be to change the wallpaper. Now I've held my finger down on a empty space on the home screen, waited for the vibration and I can now choose wallpapers from gallery, live wallpapers or photos. Now I'm going to choose live wallpapers just to show you an example. No I'm not because it doesn't have any pre-installed. So I'm just going to go into the wallpapers on the device and I've got a variety of wallpapers that I can scroll through. Now I want something pretty unique and different. I like... Uh, what do I like? I like the first one actually. So I'm going to go ahead and tap set wallpaper and as you can see my first part of the customization process is complete. Now I feel that there's too much empty space so let's go to the set the actual main menu. Now you normally see applications but at the top there's an, a, a category called widgets. So if I click widgets you can scroll through and see which widgets you like. Now one of my favorite ones would be a, a nice big clock. So digital clock I'm going to hold down and drag it onto the center of my page and as you can see I've managed to drag it, in fact let's resize it so it's now centered so I now have a digital clock on my home screen maybe I want a couple more applications that I use on a regular basis so I will go in um, to the main menu, find some applications that I want. I'm a massive user of the calculator so I hold down on the calculator widget and I drag it anywhere within these sort of grids that appear underneath my finger. So I've let go and it's there. Now you actually have about five screens that you can customize but I'm just going to show you the one for now. Let's have another application here or let's see what are the widgets that we've got. So if I go back to widgets at the top, maybe I want a, a small email widget. So I'm gonna hold down, drag it into that space there, and there's no more room. So I'm gonna have to choose another application and I'm going to choose voice search. That seems to be a, a suitable option. So I've finally finished my customization of the home screen. I could go a different route and fill it with more widgets rather than applications, but I'm happy with the way it is. So feel free, have a play around, put your favorite applications on your home screen or home screens. You can have a different home screen for work, home, weekend, you know, it's really your device to customize. That's how to customize your home screens or home screens on your Moto E.